Did you know that falls are the leading cause of fatal injuries in people over 65? Your balance gets worse as you get older. Studies have proven that balancing on one foot can help. Here's a fun way to improve your balance that your whole family can enjoy. Can you walk a straight line, heel to toe? If you can, then slacklining might be for you. It's bouncy like a trampoline. It's fun and you'll improve your balance. If you're ever on Survivor, this will come in handy. First, get yourself a 50 foot slack line. They sell for $50 and up. Find a safe place to rig it. Uh, across the snowmobile trail is a horrible place, but it's my private trail, so it's okay. Make sure there's nothing hard uh, to bang your head on. Over grass, sand, or, or uh, water is ideal. I don't have that option today. Make sure there's no sticks, stones, or broken glass. I promise you, you'll be falling off a lot. So fall safely. I'm anchoring to a couple of trees that are about 15 paces apart and at least a foot wide. Anything solid will do. First, I wrap the tree with a towel to protect it. Then I bring a close close pin just to hold it in place. Keep the slack line rolled up and I wrap it around the tree. Shove it through this loop here. You throw it. Half loop in here, half bend in here to get the slack line to stay flat. So it's just a, a, a U bend basically. And I mount it high enough that it won't touch the ground when I'm standing on it. And for me, that's about knee high. Then I run the line out flat like this. And I make sure there's not, it's all flat. On the other side is the winch. And I've looped it around the tree already, just same as the other one. And I put a half twist in it as well. And then this is the winch here. And it's very important that the winch operate like this. You don't want it, if it's underneath, you won't be able to tighten it. There's a slot here, and that's where the line goes through. So the line comes through, and then it just folds underneath it. And then I can pull the slack in the line out. And once I've done a hand pull, I've shoved the line through this slot and I make sure, made sure the rack, ratchet's on top. And then I just ratchet it tighter. And I'm putting my whole body weight behind it to tighten it. I pull the line tight and ratchet it tighter. The shorter and tighter the line, the easier it is to walk. It's a cinch with a winch. You want to get on in the middle of the line. It's tempting to, to uh, want to get on, and you probably will just get on at the tree the first time just to, because you're nervous. But if you go slow, you'll shake more. So if I go like this, you can see the line's shaking a lot, and I can instead hop up and Bob's your uncle. Find your balance, knees slightly bent, chin up, and pick a spot on the tree to, at eye level to focus on. Keep your hips and shoulders above your feet. Keep your head over the slack line. Record yourself from the side and watch to see what you're doing. You'll learn faster and you'll get some funny videos. Keep your toes on the line. Take it one step at a time. It's a cakewalk. There's a lot of tension on the line. When you start to fall, jump off. It's as easy as falling off a log. Uh, take your time. It's not like you're going anywhere. After your first five minutes, you may feel like giving up, but don't give up. Build your confidence by having a shoulder to uh, lean on or get some ski poles or crutches. I'll show you what that is. 
ski poles. You can kind of balance yourself. You stay on the line. And, and it's fun. Part of the fun is to make it bounce. So make it bounce. <laughs> Yeah. 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 Oh, awesome. Now bounce. And bounce. <laughs> I like that he's confident. He's not scared. <laughs> That's fairly interesting. This is the What to Know Show with your host, Tito Waylon.